massive um, and results in fact support that. Um, when Newcastle uh, significantly upgraded their results in the last nine games of the season, I think the impact of two people changed everything for us. Graham Jones from Monday to Friday and from the tactical bench on match day and Joe Willock on the pitch. The reason Newcastle got out of trouble comfortably in the end, apart from the, the bottom three being so horrendous, was because of Willock and Jones. There's, in my eyes, there's absolutely no question of that. Jones did a superb job. Uh, he came here, he was... When you call him a front foot coach, I don't mean that Newcastle played on the front foot after he came because they didn't have 65, 70% possession, etc, etc. But what they did was when turnovers came, they went direct for the throat of the opposition. When they got a turnover, they went forward and they went forward with pace and they committed people forward. They weren't doing that, they were going square and backwards in the original setup, they were so timid it was untrue. Jones decided that when we got the ball, the pace we had with Almiron and Sir Maximum and Willick, and let's get at them on the counter and let's make it, uh, and Wilson when he was in the side before he was injured at the end, uh, let's get at them and it worked and the influence that Jones had, I mean I referred to it in a Chronicle article at the time, we had a good January, you know, in the transfer market, and we only got two people. One of them was Willock, and one of them was Jones, who we didn't need to do in, the, in that transfer market. But those two signings in January were hugely significant.